Hello everyone and welcome to Jojo's Brick Time. We have another storybook here. This time it's the Lego Disney The Little Mermaid storybook. Now I liked the look of this set because I wanted some more micro dolls and we get Ursula the Sea Witch there, a new darker skinned Little Mermaid and a new Prince Eric. Uh, $33 at the Lego store. I found it in Kmart for $29, so not much discount. Let's see what we get. With the stickers, we get a lot less of the little stickers that we normally get with the storybooks. So they're nice and colourful. We get a gold binder here and the book, and it's very scratched my section there. That side's okay. But I am loving this print of Ariel and Ursula there. Very good quality printing, I have to admit. Two little bags here. That's because there's only 134 pieces. And now the instruction booklet, well, leaflet. I'd rather booklets. But anyway, don't forget to like and subscribe. Alrighty, let's build. Little Prince Eric here is micro doll, loving his little face, his little eyebrows there, his little grin. No printing on the back like usual, but I think he's wearing more formal attire this time rather than his casual outfit. And I am loving his brown hair. Hang on, I thought he had black hair. Hmm. Now we've got Ariel here and I'm loving her facial expression. It is so pretty. I am loving her shell top, her little tail there. It's got sparkles, very pretty. Now she is wearing this hair. This is Andrea's style hair. And I think that red color used to be Mia's original color. I'm gonna pop her hair back on. She will be wearing this yellow flower. Like, I like the look of her. She's very pretty. Ursula the Sea Witch. Now, this is why I really bought the storybook for. I am loving this micro doll. Love her raised eyebrow with her green eye makeup. The tentacles have been done really well for a little micro doll. And we're going to pop her hair on. So that's her crazy white hair. It is slightly different to the original Ursula. So here's the Ursula I have. Um, they misprinted. They didn't put her little beauty spot there, which is a big thing for her, I think. But anyway, they did a good job with her tentacles on the micro doll. Um, I prefer the older hairstyle, though. This is meant to be Sebastian the Crab. I'm really disappointed in that, but I haven't seen the live action movie, so I can't, you know, judge. Let's begin the build by putting the storybook together. These pins are always so difficult to put in. Just be careful so you don't break them. And I found a better way, just stick it up like this. <laughs> Let's pop this one together so that's all done. I'll just test it that it works. And now I need to do the little lock mechanism. So this is the little lock that you'll use the key for. And I can't see what I'm doing here. It is meant to be put into that little hole there. I'll just test it with the key and see if it locks. And yep, it does. This little build is some rocks and coral and she has found a fork, a bottle and a telescope. This will be Prince Eric's statue and it's going to spin round and round. This is just to hold a sparkly little shell. Ursula's little magic area. Time to pop the stickers in. There are a lot less stickers in this set. These ones are a lot larger. So they go on like this. This is just to add a lot more details. They're looking all right, I like them. Easy to put on. 
Now I just have to pop all the little builds in. This is a double-sided build and we're going to have Ariel's contract here to sign over her voice. So that goes there. And then on this side we are going to have a hidden treasure map and some more treasures there from Ariel. This is the middle section that's going to have Ariel's shell throne. Let's test out this throne, pop Ariel in and you cannot close it while she's sitting on her throne. Another double sided build, this will have a little globe and we're going to put in a book because this side will be like a little library. I don't know how the pages stay dry when they're underwater but anyway, <laughs> pop that on there. Let's pop everything in the storybook. So this one goes on this side and you've got to lift up the little contract there above the lip. This is Ariel's throne and the little library area. Pop Ursula in, I love her. Little Ariel will go here and Prince Eric will be hiding under the water and the crab, can't call him Sebastian. Let's close this up. And there we are, there's the storybook all complete. Ariel is in love with Prince Eric's statue. Prince Eric is getting a book from the library. Apparently he can breathe underwater. Ursula's in her underwater cave making up a potion. Ursula's being chased by the crab while Ariel sits on a throne and Eric's on top of the arch. The Little Mermaid storybook. Um, look, I personally bought this for the micro dolls. I wasn't really interested in the rest of the set. I love the printing. The stickers are great. I am so disappointed about the crab, the Sebastian, but I, like I said before, I haven't seen the movie, so I guess they couldn't make it like the original cartoon. Where's Flounder? Um, there's just a few bits missing in this. I actually prefer the previous storybook of The Little Mermaid. But anyway, everyone, get your bricks out. <laughs>